What is going on, you lot? Midi here. Guys, do I have the absolute most craziest game going on? Let me get my little checkbox out. All PC Sweat Squad. Check. Ruby. Check. Army of Darkness and being able to loop and not do anything about it. Check. Split capping. Check. All the tick boxes were checked. A lot of other demon players in games like this would just instantly quit the game. They'd be like, I'm done. I'm out. I'm not dealing with it. And some demon players even quit out when they see Ruby. And this gameplay is going to be the most perfect example on why you can just come back from any game. It doesn't matter if they've got the best advantage in the world. There's always going to be a window of opportunity somewhere. As for the build, completely not expecting to the elites at all for this. So we're not expecting to elites. We've got the damage with our boss here. It's kind of the same as you always see it from before. Making sure we've got the jump scare on that reduce the duration of charge before or demonic dash you guys have seen this from gameplay that i'm doing recently you're able to land your dashes a lot easier you're going to be able to reduce all of the cooldowns if you've got stuff like grandmaster dash on and then having tenacious demonic dash on as well i think just having them three things on instead of maxing out the elite seems to benefit me a lot into the early game that's the build as always make sure you guys smash like on the video support the channel out you guys are going to like the gameplay i start getting absolutely slammed and i was going to quit and then i thought no just like in my head was telling me do it midi get up and win that game you guys are going to like it let's go my right, lads, let's do it. Plaguebringer into the mix. Who are we going against? Ed, Ruby, oh, oh, oh. Warrior Ash, and then Cheryl. Do you know what? It could be a lot worse. There could be a Hunter Ash instead of the Ed. I think if they had David, Ruby, Hunter Ash, and Warrior Ash, oh my god. I don't know if I'd ever be able to win a game like that. Well, maybe one day. Okay. We got the Army of Darkness map. It's not too bad. Personally, I do like playing the map, but they've still not sorted out where you're not able to jump over certain vault locations with your basic units, which, yeah. A survivor could just drag you over there, keep vaulting. There's nothing you can do. It's honestly painful. Let's hope they don't. Let's trap all this area out. Oh, they've got the legendary Ed specialty coming to clutch here. And they're definitely going to find this. It's in the most obvious area here. They will be hit level three. Let's get basics. Okay, I'm going to put one more trap down. One more there, and then we can go on a little bit of a hunt for them. Open them up here on west side. If they're not, always south. It's going to be very painful because obviously Ruby and Ash's damage reduction when he uses the ability. It's going to be like near impossible to kill him. Right, lovely. They're actually over here. Which I didn't think they would be. I thought they were going to be south. Okay, we've got the Cheryl. We can. That's what we can do. It's a basic. Might need to put a little bit of pressure on her. Come here, Cheryl. Let's... Hey, hey, come here. Come here. Oh, no. We knew that was coming. We knew it was coming on this map. Nah, um, not even worth. Not even worth it. She's out of position here a little bit. Might be able to get a couple hits. Oh, she's going to dodge that trap perfectly. Look, no. It's like the only trap I didn't get. Yep. She's going through. Yep. And just stuck. And she can't do nothing. Oh, God. So not only have they got Ruby, Warrior Ash. Well, oh, my God. We're going to have to deal with the vaulting situation as well. There's absolutely no counter to it, which is the worst part about it. Oh, -ho -ho. sometimes you just got to remember when you're playing Demon, when you get in a scenario like that, just drop Demon. Just drop what you're doing. Go for something else. Go for something else. It's actually possible here. And uh, trying to get someone that you're never actually going to be able to touch. Not worth it. Ruby is over here. It's here. Head falls down. Okay. Get our infernal energy maxed out here. Oh, Shell's taking car. Might be able to do a bit of damage with vehicle here. Not a bad strike. Can normally you've got max infernal energy. You can normally almost down them. I'm gonna take car for a sec. Try and flip this. Again, army of darkness. There's so many cars on this map that you know I flip one car, 20 more ready. Very painful map for sure. Um, yep. They've got a card there. She's getting into this one. Let's see if I can damage over it. Oh. Oh. You know what I'm saying, though? That's what I mean. Wait, let's get the dash on. Come on, stand still. Nice. Get the basic. She's kind of in open area. Yeah? Well, I'm telling you, if they're like 70% HP and you've got full infernal energy, you could probably get a down with a car. Oh, come on, please. Oh, yeah. Come on! Yes. You stay right there, mate. Stay right there! They're, they're even vaulting over the logs! I didn't even know it was possible. Vaulting over the fucking logs. Crazy! It's crazy! We need more infernal energy anyway. 
Uh, Warrior Rash is by himself. I'm debating whether this is worth going after. Where is he going? Okay, he's just disappeared. I had this fear just shoot down there. Did he jump out the card and use his ability or something? Or did he just jump out and go near a campfire? Um, I've kind of lost track of him. He was there? Okay, well, no, I'm just going to go back. Oh, man. I feel like this team is going to put me on a wild goose chase. I'm expecting it already. It's the sort of team that would bait you into the objective. So, like, they would start the point. You go over there. They'd get in the vehicle, drive off. You can already smell what they're going to be doing. One damage over here. Nope. Come on. I don't think you should be able to dodge this. You see how she's holding the vehicle? I feel like if you're touching them in the vehicle, you should always be able to damage them. Oh, come on. All right, let's go for Ruby. Is that all my traps here? You just got to, It's always about prioritizing what you're doing. You know what I mean? You want to go after the target, you'll be able to do the most damage with, aka Ruby for the minute. All right, there's quite a lot of traps here, so hopefully. So, oh, Ed. Mate, they got it real quick. One minute of there. Next to him. Oh, perfect. Had a bit more infernal energy there. I would have had to get a few spins in. Oh, got that. And they are going for that legendary, man. They smelt it. I told you at the start of the game, they're coming straight over it. They can just smell where the legendaries are. Oh, I've got no infernal energy here. They've literally trapped me in. Oh, God. I'm going to get some damage off the traps, I guess. They're still not got the map pieces, though. So we've got an opportunity to do a bit more damage with them. Having Shovel on her team. Oh, man. She's just got a lot of shemps. Yeah, they've got Ed as well. Completely forgot. Okay. His ability means I'm just get rid of the traps. All right. He's gone. Fine. I'm scaring. Ooh, beautiful. That, that's what I'm saying about the reduced cooldown with the dash. Very good. Fill up the Infernal Energy and go for round two. Let's zone out Ash for a bit. We just tried to get the spins in just before you're about to die. Maximize that damage out. That's second map piece. Probably just going up here for supplies. Cauldron down. This was not the plan. Right. Try yeah, let's go. Spins it is. Spin to win. Oh! Right. I just got nothing final in here to possess this. Right, I think he's popped ability there. I'm going to be doing absolutely no damage whatsoever. Stage 5 Warrior Ash. Absolutely deadly with the chainsaw. If he's running like a sort of chainsaw build, yeah. Deadly. Yay. I'm not even going to chase him to the top of that building. I know I had Demonic Dash there. I'd rather just get a couple traps out. And now, try and get the levels that I'm almost 10 here. So if I can just scrape getting level 10, maybe I can go after the Cheryl. I don't know... Let's try it. So close here, right? She's gone off to do the map pieces, I guess. While they're just looting up. Right. That is boss. Let's see what we can do. If she makes any mistakes here. I'm just going to cutscene. Potion down. Come on. Try and get the screams in. Want to stack damage with this. Nice. Come on, anytime. Nice. No! Yes, I got her. Oh, my God. That is not the place where I'd expect the grab to work. Oh, she got through the window there. Nice. Yeah, she got a cola in here. Normally, it goes through the wall, I think. Does it? Wait, what? Oh, wait. Yeah, she's got max blight stacks there. And essentially, I can't really do anything. It's like she could just keep looping this position, and that is it. AI perfectly spawns there, right? I'm trying to block window here. Can you block window? You can. One more potion down. Oh, another window here. There's like three windows. It's one bit. Three. Yep. Not going to be able to do anything here. And I've got no infernal energy. Might as well just go back to the team. I can't believe that they've left that in the game for so long. I know that you can't vault with the bosses. I just mean basic units. Not being able to vault. Oh, essentially, it means Army of Darkness map. If survivors know what they're doing, it's a survivor favoured map. What is it? You can take the vaulting out of the question, and then I'll say it's a demon one. 
Right, they are level 11. They can just start point here. I have no idea, really. I can't really do much. Like, Cheryl can just infinity loot. So, kind of stuck there. Go to the other team. They're going to start point. Right. The pages of started pages. By the mortals. Shred their flesh Love it how they started return. the further point away as well. Oh, man. I'll be honest. With Ruby, I don't think I'm going to be able to do much on this point. Let's go. Stop point. Let's see what we can do. Dish out damage here. Nice. Jump scare in. Reduce some cooldowns. Oh, no. Uh, wait. Cool. At least I can land a lot more. Let's get the elite for a sec. Just for the uh, corrosive blast here. Into the stomps. Hey, they are ripping the mobs out, though. A show has gone for a split cap here. I actually don't know what is a smarter point. We'll do a little bit of damage here and then we'll go over. Because I'd rather them get one point than, you know, this. They obviously bait me as well. I'm hard. Oh, I don't know what to do. Such a bad scenario, isn't it? Standing on top of a rock. In the, like, you know they're going to use every little exploit to their advantage here. Can I even fucking reach her? Wait. And it's like she just knew I was going to do it. Crazy. Crazy. I don't think I can even do anything here. I'm trying to get to the car. Yep. And they came straight back over to this point. Oh, my God. The only advantage right now is that I don't think they've looted completely well. They did have the legendary for sure. But I don't know. Trying to get screams out. Stack that damage, man. Get another one out. Oh, we're down already. Oh my god. Oh, Ruby. Jesus Christ, man. You might. How'd you know? Wait. Did Ruby's ability work? Oh my god. Right now, I'm turning more into like a punching bag for him. Just trying to waste ammo, really, at this point. Hopefully, Ed wastes enough ammo that on the dark ones, he's not going to have that much. Wow. And then they've got second point as well, very easily. You can just drive straight back over there. That is crazy. Level 15. Woo. Now, I know it's really hard at the minute. Like, they've got every early advantage on me whatsoever. But you've always got a chance on book. You always do. You have to remember that. I have been in so many scenarios with like absolute sweat fests like this, and I've still won a book. Ups down. Obviously got this point, so one jump scare in. I mean, look, by the campfire, perfect on point. Perfect position to stand on point. Okay. Ed knows how to dodge. Oh, maybe don't. Get the spins in just before we die. It's actually going to be too much. Might be able to get a couple more spins just before we go. Here we go. Boss. Ooh, it's I'm going to max out the elites just to be safe. Be safe on point. The dark ones. Wow, they're already on dark ones. What? Oh, my God. That's like they've pre-marked that. One's gone off and gone. Yep, you do that. I'll rush this. It's like the ultimate rush. I, mean, I can imagine they already saw this. Go. Really? If I can get a pick off on point, maybe. Might be in luck. Woo! Alright. Gonna put a marker down for one of the elite traps. Just in case we get put on book stage very quickly. Dash. Uh, what can we do? Put that boss here. They're gonna hold it. Right, I'm gonna wait for it. Come. Let's go. Throw them off point all the way up here. They're just going to put me on book stage, so let's throw them all the way up here. Nope. Oh no, they activated the portal there. They'll probably put it in a better spot, to be honest with you. What are they doing? Cheryl's gone off to loot. Are they, are they this cocky? I don't think that was actually the play, though. Might be able to get a kill, you know. Can we? Yeah, fuck it. I could have put Cauldron down. They're just going to move out of it. Let's see what we can do here. Might be able to get Ed down. He's dodges ain't on point. 
shoot. Potion down, drag him into the dark ones. I think Cheryl's gone looking for ammo or colas. I don't know what one. Okay, Ruby's half health here. Nice. Come on, one more. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Nice! Don't ever underestimate that scream damage. It does a lot, man. As soon as you hit him a couple times with it, woo! That's it, the hand down. Remember, it does more damage each time you use it. Right. Oh, the damage! Let's make sure she don't get the revive here. I don't get why they didn't just start book. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, that's so close. That's two colors gone. Let's waste time. Possession. Damage if we can. Waste a bit of ammo. Him, actually. I'm doing nothing with that. Okay, let's get jump scare. There we go. Beautiful. Gonna reduce cooldowns too. Back into basic. Let's let her die. Nice. What a dumb move. What are they doing, man? You know what I mean? You're, you're being too cocky. Like, yeah, let's go off and go loot for some more shit in castle while we leave this point on nothing. Weird way to play. Oh, it's car gone. Might be able to delay a little bit of time on altar here. Oh, let's see if I'm quick enough, though. All right. Aldrin. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, no, she's got revive here. Nope, too slow. I could have put the portal down in a better spot there and got there just before. Pin her in corner, nope. Okay, now they got to start the dark ones, right? Let's try and delay time here. Delay a little bit of time, you little sweaty fucks. You sweaty fucking PC! Come here, PC boy! Right, spin. Complete. Right. Okay, he's just popped a bit at here, so I'm going to be able to do a lot of damage. Okay. Drop that. Right. Have a jump scare. Come on. Nope. Okay. Wait for him to get a little bit closer, get the jump scare in. Oh, of course we missed it. Cool, so right. Just put him on book stage, just go. Why are you guys being so cocky? Just start book. Wasting my time. There we go, beautiful. Alright. Sweat Squad, be my book rotation. Let's see how it goes down. Get the basic out. I'm going to go for the spins here as well. I didn't really melt this down. Spins in. Spin at. Always make sure you're moving when you spin. Don't ever sit there like a sitting duck. Right, round two of the spins. Boom, 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 boom. Right. You can always go for the pierce ability. Piercing does a lot of damage on boot. Right. Ruby's wasted that. Let's get Cauldron and Elite. Switch the Elites. Remember, I'm not expecting to Elites here. Look. Bang, bang. That's five hits. Come on. Six. Six hits with the Elites. Massive. Back again with the basics. Spins again. Keeping them all away from me. Okay. Fine. I try to wait my... Try to let my infernal energy go up a little bit. Just so I'm able to spin enough here. There we go. I can tell you right now, if that Hunter Rash would be even worse. Okay. It's not bad book damage. Let's get another elite out here. Right. Let's target it there. there we go. Heavies into stomp. Always. Come on. Oh, almost. Come on, give me a basic. No. Jump scare. When you got nothing, jump scare. Reduce cooldowns. Boom. Get the basics and leads back on the field. Oh, mate, this is going to be so close. Spins in. Into Pierce. That's the only problem with Pierce. If you miss target, like, that's it. Leads. Round two. Nice. I can just get. Come on. Yes. Yes. Let's get basics. Might have been able to use Cauldron there a little bit early, but it's okay. By the time I get all my spins out, the unit's pretty much dead anyway. Cauldron's down. Oh, I'm wasting time. Give me a basic. I'm not, I'm not taking boss. I'm not taking boss. I don't need to. Come on. Ten seconds. Oh. Get the elite. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let me through. Yeah. Ah. They done everything. They had everything. They had everything. Sweat Squad still one on book. Still one on book and not spec into elites. If that shows you lot that you do not need to spec into elites to win on book, you know what I mean? 90k damage on end. <laughs>
Oh, mate, they had Ruby, they had Voltin, they had Split Caps, they had everything. Yeah, let's hold the dark ones while we go uh, loot for a bit, mate. You ballsed up massively there. Oh, mate. Good game, though. GG's.